Okay, this is Flood Arm 2, which is uh, capable of uh, sensing water levels at two different uh, points. And at the moment, we've just connected one sensor to the uh, unit. Before you start, you just need to ensure that your sounder is um, making the correct noise for your particular application. And when you get the data sheet with the sounder, you'll see that there are 32 different, 32 different um, sounds that can come out of it. And we leave it to you to change that. But at the moment it's set to the default setting, which is continuous. If you want to change it, the dip switches are just inside the um, inside the sounder there. So you push that back in, turn it to click in place, and uh, you're ready to go. So um, I'll take the lid off just so you can see a bit more clearly. And uh, if I switch it on, up the mains, switch it on you'll see that the display says uh, flood arm is standing by and when the sensor sounds it will show which sensor is actually operating but also there's an indicator lamp at the top there blue and uh, yellow which will indicate as well so I'll zoom out with that again um, so I've got a cup of uh, rainwater here which I'll use as my sample. When the alarm sounds I'll have to switch it off because you won't be able to hear me. Okay. So as you can see here as soon as it hits rainwater switched off so the blue light lights and the sound of sounds and it also says on the display which sensor is operating okay and then you and once you've wired it all up you put the lid back on and you've got an IP65 uh, enclosure if it's mounted correctly okay thanks very much bye